Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And only four teams are left in this cup competition. We're at the semi-final stage. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, what a match-up between these two excellent teams. Both have played really well to reach this stage of the tournament. But which one is going to go through to the final? I think this could be really close today. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Vitor Ferreira in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. This is what they'll be facing today. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front two, but for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. And this confrontation is underway. Nuno Mendes. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's with Joao Cancelo. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Sporar. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Now options are plenty. Must take the lead here. Oh, and it goes! The opening goal in the semi-final. A long way from being decided, but it could be telling. Let's take another look. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? It's a great turn and shot. What a good goal that is. So back underway, having conceded, let's find out if Portugal can flick a switch and come up with a goal of their own. Successfully cut out. Now, let's see what they can do here. A well, disappointing end to the move. Cristiano Ronaldo. And Ronaldo with others in the vicinity. Leal.
Well, this is a very good finish. He just does enough to get it over the keeper. He'll certainly be pleased with that. away again here on the back of that leveller Malaka using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball and that'll be a Portugal throw Palinha here's Ronaldo it's a weighted pass Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And now Ronaldo with teammates in support. Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Benjamin Sheshko. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Well, 2-1 it is here. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Minch. Ferreira. Palinha and Palinha with it Ferreira he has teammates around him the supporters want to see him have a go and a fantastic diving save and the substitution will occur now Corner, let's see. Play towards the back post. Just wanted to get it out of there. So a half an hour remaining. Moving the ball forward. How creative can they be? The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Real defensive resilience. Great block again.
Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes. Good looking sequence. Ronaldo. Oh, that's a fine save. And a substitution in the offing. Who can they pick out? And taking care of the situation. Fernandes. On to Ronaldo. The save was a good one. Short corner it is. Bruno Fernandes. Now with Silva. An alert piece of defending. Petar Stojanovic. And he did well to cut it out. The referee blows for a foul. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Palinha. But it comes down to the final five minutes. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Silva. Unless they're in attacking position, it's not too late for them. Towards Bernardo Silva. Well, the danger is still there. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. They're shielding the ball admirably. Able to deal with the threat. Climbed the mountain. They've made it through to the final here at the Euros. Well, I don't think anybody expected this, but what a performance from them. They showed great energy, they posed problems when they went forward, and they defended for their lives when it mattered. They now have to repeat that display in the final. And well, I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.